Hi, I'm Andre and I'm a black nerd and I just wanted to go ahead and talk about the elephant in the room, the red, pink, <laughs> blue, and black elephant in the room, and that is the Power Rangers movie casting. I was going to personally wait until all the Power Rangers were cast because we don't have a yellow ranger yet, but because of the last couple of casting choices, I wanted to just go ahead and make a video to talk about it. So they have been announcing the Power Rangers cast on the Power Rangers movie Instagram. Yes, the movie already has an Instagram. First one they announced was Naomi Scott as the Pink Ranger. Then they announced, I'm gonna get this dude's name wrong, uh, Dacri, 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 Dacri Montgomery? <laughs> that sounds like a drink you would get at a bar. <laughs> I would like a Dacri Montgomery, please, <laughs> and some spinach dip. D-A-C-R-E Montgomery. He is going to be the leader, the Red Ranger. Now here's where it gets interesting. Ludie Lynn or Luddy Lynn, I'm, I'm assuming it's Ludy. He is the Black Ranger, and he is Asian. And what I found interesting is that when the first two Rangers were cast, there was like no media coverage, like the news was like, there was a couple of articles sprinkled, but no one made a big deal. But this guy got cast the Black Ranger, and then all of a sudden, all the news media outlets and blogs and websites were like, well, we gotta talk about this. This is being seen as a reboot to the original Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, where the Black Ranger was black, and now the Black Ranger is not black. In this version, he is Asian. People are already trying to figure out a way to make a big firestorm out of it. And then this is what I heard as a response. Cricket, cricket. And I think the reason why is because Power Rangers, if you've watched it, any version of it, it has always been diverse. They've always had multiple races because it was something that they wanted as a key element of the show since it began. Like that's something I keep trying to remind people about when they get so mad about the race or gender changes of their comic book characters. Those characters were made in the 30s and 40s and 50s and 60s. You just couldn't put people of color into your comic books and people were okay with that thing. I mean, Charles Schultz got a bunch of crap for putting Franklin in Peanuts and that wasn't that long ago. If Power Rangers was made in the 1940s, it would have been all white dudes no question about it maybe a girl if you got lucky and she would be totally stereotypical female in it but there would not be no brothers there would not be no asians there would not be no hispanics there would not be no indians it'd be a bunch of lily white captain america power rangers the black rangers already been a not black person he was adam that, that happened like a season and a half into the show itself i mean zach is the man i love the zach man but you know two seasons in man, things got Pretty sure Saban's like, yeah, we're not gonna do that again. Black Ranger is a black dude, and Asian Ranger was a Asian Ranger was a yellow person. <laughs> We ain't doing that again. Like in my argument about why Johnny Storm could be black, the same thing goes for the Black Ranger. He could be anybody. It's about having the power coin that makes you the Black Ranger. You can change colors at any time. If you don't believe me, ask Jake from Megaforce and Super Megaforce. A color can just change like that. It wasn't the Black Ranger that made me like the Black Ranger. It was Zack. It was Walter Jones. It was the character. It was really cool being a young kid, seeing a young black teenager like myself being a superhero. He could have been the Blue Ranger, he could have been the Red Ranger, he could have been the Pink Ranger for all I care. Yeah, it was cool that the black guy was a Black Ranger, but the color of the suit didn't matter. Zack mattered. He was awesome. And yeah, sure, he hip-hop ketoed. Yeah, sure, he danced all the time. Yeah, sure, he served fried chicken at the African-American table at the food festival that the Power Rangers had in Angel Grove. Who cares, okay? That guy was someone I felt like I could relate to and it was cool seeing him as a hero. It was Zack. It had nothing to do with the color of his suit. In the same way that I connected to Billy, the Blue Ranger, because he was the dork. He was the nerd. He was the smart guy. I could relate to that. As long as there's representation there, then it's cool. And that's never been an issue with Power Rangers. So there was just nothing to really freak out about. And you could tell that Saban also understood that it might have been some because they just dropped this new news right after the other rangers they kind of spread out but with this one they're like oh we got this asian guy in the black ranger and literally the next morning like oh and by the way uh blue ranger is black i am survived yes rj siler earl from me and earl and the dying girl movie that came out a while back he is the blue ranger now the blue ranger is black and the black ranger is asian what it's a reboot son it's a reboot i wonder if they'll still have the same characteristics like will the blue Ranger be the smart one because Niff is a brother and it's a black guy and he's a nerd in this movie and I'm just saying I need a royalty check Saban you already got me one time with that mega force with a black nerd ranger don't you do that to me again you better uh, give me a cameo can I be Ernie hey kids wanna get some juice <laughs> want a smoothie <laughs> why did I do him like that that's not stereotypical hey everybody welcome to Ernest can I get you in a smoothie I'm seven dreams to the power rangers yeah <laughs>
I'm <laughs> playing a piano. I've lost my mind. What are your feelings about the casting of Power Rangers? Who do you think is going to be that Yellow Ranger? This is going to be important. Man, if they throw a black girl in there, I'd be like, dang, that's awesome. But I kind of feel like they're going to get a blonde chick. And you know, you can always find Power Rangers talk here on Black Nerd Comedy. So you're welcome or sorry. <laughs> Make sure you subscribe. I love you like a play cousin. I'm 85,000. Chain Chop. It's more for time. Yonk.